Good evening, madam. We are from Lex 2005, Group 38. Welcome to our discussion video 5. My name is Tan Xian Leng and my metric number is 195997. My name is Chia Yiching. My metric number is 197849. My name is Chi Pingjie. My metric number is 196425. My name is Yao Xiaoxing. My metric number is 196623. My name is Lian Kamala Tong Lian and my matrix number is 198289. Alright, we have conducted our online karaoke session before and the title of the song is Photograph, which is sang by singer Ed Sheeran. This song discusses a long distance relationship inspired by Ed Sheeran's own experience of being away from his then girlfriend while he was on tour. But with Ed Sheeran's releasing the music video showing all footage of him just hours before the Mother's Day. So, it makes the song's meaning move from strictly about relationship with partner to circle around family relationship. The song lyrics are admirable. <clears throat> Every single sentence of the lyrics conveys message and has own speciality. This song is not just about mending a relationship with your partner, but it is more about restoring the relationship with your family. So this is the message of this song. All right, so I will talk about the theme of this song. The theme of this song is that in the good times or bad, Love can make you feel happy even if it was love that put you in a bad place because love never dies. However, although love is good, it can also be bad which is represented by words such as hurt and bleed. Other than that, the whole song is a metaphor which has comparing photograph and love that is showing us the importance of the photograph to Ed Sheeran's love. So, the words such as uh, love, heart, soul, and heartbeat keep the presence of love throughout the song. Yeah, in my opinion, this song is giving positive impact to listener and moderator listener as well, especially to those who are in long-distance relationship. So, uh, as Yi mentioned before, this song told people a very positive message, which is in the good time or bad time, love can make you feel happy, even if it's what love that put you in a bad place, because love never dies. And this song also um, helping us to deal with the sadness, and it had a very lovely and original message. And because it motivates us to keep going, if we think our dreams are impossible. Lastly, why do I say this song mm, giving impact, positive impact to people? Because this song teach us how important to cherish your loved one or an, or no matter it's your family or another half. We need to cherish when he or she is still around you and still by your side and remember the memories and moments you have met together. After singing this song, I feel that the beauty of relationship will be kept in a photograph. This refers to all the memories we have made together. With just one photo, we can remember the life we have with someone else. Even if they are away from us, they will always be connected with the memories we have made and cherished. Refer to the visually descriptive lyrics. It discusses a long-distance relationship inspired by Sharon's own experience. But personally, I feel that this song isn't just about mending a relationship with your partner. It's more about restoring the relationship with your family, more specifically, Abe and his mother. Now looking at the lyrics, Loving Can Hurt seems to come from the mother's point of view. Taking responsibility for a child can be frustrating and difficult. Yeah, and then I think the music, the video clip has a very nice and memorable touch to the video because it shows the, the, 
the memories of Ed Sheeran's journey in pursuing his dream as a singer. And that when he was young, he already started um, doing, uh, started to play musical instruments. And also the, the relationship between him and his mom throughout his life. And also when he pursued his dream, he went and um, performed at concerts and everything. And so the strength of this video is that it gives a it gives the viewer a very um, touching moment when they see this kind of um, <clears throat> relationship portrayed in the video. And what the weakness is that the quality of the video may be in low quality because of um, filming in the, in the past, like Ed Sheeran's childhood. But um, overall, the video clip is still very memorable and touching. All right. So, would you like to recommend this song, photograph to people around you? Any suggestions? Uh, for me, I will recommend this song to my family because we can find the moral value such as family love in this song. We can also feel the warmness from it. So, I will also recommend this song with my friends to share the feelings and love together. Other than that, I've also uh, watched the relevant movie before on year 2016, which is Me Before You. The love story in this movie is really touching and earned my tears at that moment. That's why I love this song more because of this movie. So I will recommend this song to the people around me. Yeah, I agree with you. I think I also will recommend this song to others because this song makes me feel that when bad and sad times come, we can look to a photograph. The time never passed and our hearts are always in the attitude we took the photograph. I also will recommend this song for other people, especially for people, those who are currently in long-distance relationship, especially during this COVID-19 outbreak. Many people can't meet their another half uh, due to the lockdown, and many people also break up during this MCO period. So this song is a song about the special struggle of long-distance relationship, and this song also tells the message of we need to cherish others when he or she is still by your side. So when you feel like you want to give up on the relationship, look at the photograph of you and your partner and remember all the good times. Remember all the perfect moments of love with your partner and if you're another, uh, another half close to your heart to never let go. So even if you are away from your partner, and you will always be connected with the moment you have made together. Yeah, I also think that I'll recommend this song to other people because um like 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 PJ said during the COVID nineteen lockdown, everyone is reminiscing on their memories and look looking through these photographs will actually remind us of the good times of our, the good times that we have sp spent with our friends or family um, rather than focusing on the, the bad crisis we are going through. Alright, I totally agree with you all because through hearing this song, I can really feel the warmth of the song and it truly can heal our soul. Alright. So, uh, what? Well, What's our next video discussion? Do you have any ideas on choosing the time? Is and it okay dates? on next weekend? Weekend is okay for me. It is okay for me too. Maybe set mm -hmm. the same date next Saturday also again. 9.30, yeah. is it? Okay. okay. Is it okay? Yeah. So okay. our last discussion video will be held at 
9.30 p.m. on Saturday. So okay. these discussions video seems like come to an end. So let's end our discussion video. Right. Okay, see you next week. Okay, see you. Bye. 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 <laughs>